Hello, everyone. RBG Kim Kitty are back with some more. It's Blake Chronicles 3. In the previous video, we did some side content, but kind of story content as well, which was kind of comprised of doing a side content. Uh, but we did Van Damme's Air, which gave us Monica to be a party member, which, holy shit, that was a really good quest in my opinion. At least the ending was fantastic. But now we have all uh, the 300 cylinders, so let's do this so we can continue on with the story. Job well done. Someone pull all Stop well to install. Expect to be ship shaped by tomorrow morning. That soon? Someone never flounder. Always get job done. Thank you so much. Thank you, not necessary. Someone is fixer up her by trade. What's that? Ah, this is Ultimate Vessel. Ultimate Vessel? That right. Even Vortex Enraging Great Sea Not Slow Advance, it'd go down in history as Queen of Boats. Still work in progress, but sure to bring to fruition someday. It's someone's dream. Wow. Interesting. Wonder why that got brought up. Ah, now I gotta go back to the dorms. Okay. All right, I didn't know that that was happening. I feel like there's, you know, been a longer cutscene or something. I feel like I should just fast travel here so then I can just walk this path. Wait a minute, is there a way? Hmm. I'm curious if there's actually a way for me to get in there with, because the door's locked. Fuck it, let's see if there is. I have nothing else better to do for a little bit. Plus, it doesn't. I don't think it's going to take that long. So. Let's see. Here. Yeah, we gotta go. There is a ladder over there. Yep, okay. I think that is exactly how you're supposed to get in there. Unless there's a door in front of me from getting in there. There's a ladder something right there. That's the ladder right here, right? Oh, there it is. More snake. Let's use this. Snake eater ladders. Yeah, that meant close to the end of the last video. not the way I wanted to go for the vein. I'm curious to see what's up here. Oh, I think I know what's up here. It might be a secret area. You know something I just kind of realized? I mean, maybe this is what the discussions are. There's no heart to hearts in this game. I just, re I can't believe like what? This is like part 30 something. And I just now realize that there's no heart to hearts in this game. I can't believe it take, took me that long to realize. I'm like, wait a minute. There's no heart to hearts. But again, I feel like how the game is set up and everything else with like those, um, with the, um, we should probably eat something. I got one more thing. Uh, how, how it's set up with the, uh, um, the discussions and all that stuff. I feel like that kind of takes the heart to hearts out. You know, like that's the replacement for heart to hearts. Totally not bad in any shape or form either. Like I, if I'm being honest, I somewhat prefer the discussions a little bit more. 
Um, not, I really did love the hard to hearts in 1 and 2 as well, which I think was fantastic, don't get me wrong. But the fact that, like, some of them had to be... Well... The Xenoblade Chronicles 2 didn't really need to be... The good news with the Xenoblade Chronicles 2 hard to hearts were, uh... Uh, the things with Xenoblade Chronicles 2's hard to hearts is you didn't need to have them in the active party, uh, to do them. Like, when it became, when it was, like, more akin to the, uh, to the, to, like, the party members. But if they involve blades, then it makes sense that they need to be, you know, active when it came to the blade side of those things. And Xenoblade Chronicles 1 had kind of, like, that issue as well, where you need to actually have the party member out and about. And then Future Connected, it was a little bit better, I think. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and then, of course, you had to be at a certain affinity rank with that person, too. It couldn't be just the flat out, oh, hey, you're like. Ugh, that smarts. Couldn't just be like, oh, hey, you can, like, do this, you know. I won't open it. Because I have a feeling it's going to contain way more containers and, or things, you know. Either way. Um, so, I, I like that. Uh, in the sense that in, Z in the future connected one as well. Didn't matter what time of day. I think Xenoblade Chronicles 2 didn't matter for the time of day either. GG asking big help here. Friends in? Of course. Shina, are you in? I guess. Maybe you could try asking someone. Can we help you? Uh, Ouroboros! What do you guys say to a treasure hunt? Because we're about to go on one. What now? Yeah, right now. But I warn you, it's pretty hard. We were just looking for more people to join in too. But this special treasure hunt only kids can play. Why does that matter? Who cares as long as we're all having fun? Why? Don't be such a stick in the mud. Anyway, you made it and you're a grown-up, aren't you? So it's fine. GG's, got too quick. Well, if you need us that much, we'll help. We do, it'll be embarrassing if we can't solve these clues. And there are so many, please. Fine, fine, you've twisted our arms. We'll help a little bit, okay? Yay, thank you. Very well, GG, explain the rules. These clues lead to three boxes, which all are, are all in city. Each person follow one clue and bring box back here, okay? What exactly are these boxes? Apprentice and appearances and form is different each from other. Everything else is trade secret. But they're all marked with an X. It's good that you've marked them. Team of all balls get this clue. At foot of 15 lights. Eh, what's that meant to be? It's a clue, duh. I don't get it all, though. Ugh, what a faff. Okay, so what does foot mean? Is the box at the bottom of something? And then there's this 15 lights business. So what we're looking for is a lot of light sources. Theoretically, if we search at the bottom of it, we should find something. I wonder what it'll be. You save those brains for our own clues. It takes some time, so get solving. Solving now. Okay, I'm definitely gonna find it. Yeah. You better get searching for us too, I guess. Yeah, let's try to find some lights that fit the bill. Unsolved riddles. The number of lights doesn't match what we're looking for. I don't think this is it. I think Kavada can be pretty pushy sometimes, right? She seems really scary at first. Once you get to know her, you'll get that she's always taking care of us. And she has a great rep for trained newbies. Once she told me that she was pouring all the energy from the kids that she didn't have into making us strong. Having kids is the norm in the city, so people whisper about it. But she laughs it off. Says you find your own way in life. I think she's so cool. I hope I can be like the captain and choose my own way to live too. 
Yeah, I just heard. Marco's going with you in the front light. She must be brave to take that step. Don't know if I have it with me to make a decision like that. Goronaka never made it back, and never did you. That's the thing about fighters. When they come up against something scary, they can't just pretend they didn't see it. Sorry, didn't mean to pile more worry on you like that. It's all into your lives. Nothing's more important after all. Oh, I'm sorry. There. All done. Wow! Amazing! Okay, I'll back to you the next one. I even brought the materials and stuff. Make me something mega cool, yeah? Sure. What kind of blade do you want? Sword? Gun? Fists! Okie dokie. Hey. Hmm? Is Lance gonna be wondering why there's no one that looks like him? If we didn't have to fight each other, you think that could have been Yorin? Oh, nope. Even more serious. Yorin? Did you ditch training again just to work on this stuff? Did not. I'm not skiving. I just had a bad headache. I gave notice too. Excuse me? No one did that for you, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm used to doing it. Okay, it's done. Hold on. Is that... <laughs> Who's that? Lance? This one's Uni, and this is Noah. Hey! That looks just like me! Good job, matey! Huh? I love it, Euron. Uh, yeah? Yeah. We don't have your talent. All we can do is slash and shoot each other. But you create things. <laughs> hey, so who's this? We know someone like that. Looks like a real tough fella. Um, that's... Uh, it's me. What? what? This is you. It looks nothing like you. Mm -mm. Yeah, but, like, that's what I want to end up like someday. <laughs> Silly, huh? It's not silly. I believe in you. I've seen exactly what you can do. You think he's got what it takes? You're talking out your bum. No, I'm not. He can do it. Right, Jorn? Uh, uh, I'll try then. I'll try really hard. He looked up to me, man. Smiley. Sometimes it's hard to judge, huh? What we're supposed to be protecting. It all gets a bit blurry. Yeah. Even so, his smile was the real thing. We should cherish that. Next time we'll think twice about who really needs punching. Yeah. Yeah. I hear you. Fist bump, buddy. Hell's yeah. So you saw it? Huh? Your husk. 
Your own lifeless husk. You've mm -hmm. come across it. How did you... Your eyes. You looked like you were gazing into your own past. That's crazy. Live long enough and you learn how to figure out stuff like that. Oh, it hasn't been as long as you think. But folk do tell me I'm pretty sharp. <gasps> that all? How come you don't wake these guys up? Couldn't you use the help? Or is it because they'd just be Mobius fodder? They can't be fodder. If we wake them up here, they'll be freed from the shackles of the flame clock. So why They won't then? be freed from their shackles because of the... Because this is our fight. We don't or know that. how long it'll take. And their lives are short. Yeah, I was about to say, they so have the... So don't want to get them mixed up in everything. They, so they still have their <sighs> time limit. That's one reason. And the other? People need to learn who they really are. What they have to leave behind for posterity. I want them to wake up in a world that affords them that chance. How do we discover who we really are? That from the husk. Yeah. You won't find yourself there. Huh? You've got to look to the present and the future only. The one in the past, it isn't you. You didn't make that and it's not yours. Make that? But... Look to the future, and you can build yourself up however you like. You can become yeah. whoever you want to be. Want my nose against the mic? I can. So I was getting. A You've drink. got the power to do so. Be true to yourself. You must be true to your heart. Thank you. That's. Well, that's what my dad always said. And your Van Ann's the smartest person ever. Mm. But it goes for you too. True to myself. We'll see. We'll see. <sighs> really? Did you seriously just burn your tongue again? <laughs> ah, you saw that. Well, your soup is one of the highlights of my day. <laughs> really? Whoa, thanks. I'm flattered. It was just the truth. <laughs> Want some to taste test? For real? Oh, good thing I got off early. Okay, I'm glad we're seeing some more interactions between the non um Ouroboros people. This is good. I think this is like kind of like the early bits here. You enjoy cooking? Oh, it's been drilled into me. It's a ritual now. Can't really start the day without making a pot. I get you. Two months, huh? Since that battle. Yeah. You're tough. No joke. Wait hey. a minute. We heard from uni that you're just like us. So it's already been two months since they've been Ouroboros, so she only has one month left. What oh, the fuck? that part. I've been plodding along, playing it all cool, but when we saw him again, I thought, nah, snuff all of this. I'm scared too, just so you know. Since Monica told us the whole truth, I've hoped, no, I'm sure I'll see Miyabi again. I'm so sure of it. Hard, wasn't it, hearing that? Yeah, but it sure beats ignorance. That's what Noah thinks, too. You're hard as nails. What we don't know might as well not exist. It's an obvious way to think, but it isn't right. Mm -hmm. Closing my eyes doesn't mean evil disappears. And so you go on? Yeah, I'll keep going while my flame still flickers to the bitter end. With all of you. You said it. 
I like this. I said it before and I said it again. I'm glad we got some interactions between, you know, the non, obviously from the part, like, obviously from the, obviously, the, you know, the Cavazzi and Agni sides, they, they have their interactions. Because, yeah, of course they would because, they you know, they've been together. But I'm glad, like, I mean, Tyon also ha kind of has, like, an interaction with Lance. And that's, I think that's kind of the first time we saw Neo interact with Lance outside and of course, like, they have the, it in some of the side content as well, but this is, I think, the first time we've... Well, not the first time, but, like, kind of, like, really... Not really hit at home, but it's like, hey, it's kind of, like, interacting between each other as well. It's not just Neo only interacting with Noah and such like that. The ship's ready. Mrs. Sama must have pulled an all-nighter. It's all going to kick off soon. The preparation should also be complete. Let's rendezvous with Mrs. Sama at the port. Let's. But first, let's complete this side quest that we have going on. Twelve. Oh, I think that's what it is. It's right there. That's the twelve lights. Is the one over there by the by the memorial stones? Hey, boomer. Boom, dum, hum, dee, dum. That's a different tune to the one that was on the sheet music. Did you make it up yourself? Sounds great. Hum dum dum dee hum dee hum dum. This old dude hardly ever says anything, huh? At first, I was kind of thinking like the clue was maybe about these statues, but we didn't get a thing for that. So I guess my next mint was this one here. Our ancestors fought om and om once. Now all seem to do is bicker pointlessly amongst each other. In particular, the heads of House Doyle and House Kanasi don't get on and well with the likes of Monica and I. That said, we're all on the same side when it comes to helping Ouroboros. Foxy. However you look at it, Gurunaka was a great man and a heroic fighter. He see his position as elder to Monica so that he could carry on fighting on the front lines. Each time he rode back into the city on his levness, he brought back a brand new tale of valor and daring do. This night certainly wasn't the only one who was eager to hear them either. He inspired courage in all of us, not just the lost numbers. He was a great example, right up to his final moments. Can't see a mark on it. Don't think this box we're looking for. Ah, holding this one, huh? Well, it seems like we only got two more places to explore. I hope it's one of them and not well, a situation where you have to look at all of them before you could do them. Is it difficult to become an old boss candidate? Hell yeah, to qualify you have to pass the exam and that's held just once every four years. Only ten can get in, four of which are reserves. There are a lot of applicants, but only the very best make it. That was an old board. Smells good. Kind of there. How about we grab something? I see a mark on it, but I don't think that's the box we're looking for. You're breaking into the prison camp. Good luck with that. Huh? How'd you know about that? Mission gathering is what I do. What is a good comeback when I need one? Where can I find the ladder for this? Looks like I need to be like above. Yeah, that's what it looks like to me. And I can carry a great tune. I feel so cheery and breezy when I hear it, like I could get through anything. Some people don't like it though. You can't defeat Mobius with music, they say. But I think the world of Granddad. I want to help people encourage others, not fight or hurt them. Aww, I like that kid. Mm. 
That might be the best way is to climb up that way again. So we'll just see. For this area is really good. I don't think I can get there from here. Let's see, maybe I can jump down from up there. As long as I survive the fall. Oh, there's the fucking ladder. God damn it. Like, I know there's a ladder, but it's not letting me get to... Oh my god, was there a better way up here too? I'm going to be pissed. I'm going to be mad if there was a better way up... Well, let's see if this is the actual one first before I try it. Oh, that looks like 12. Or 15. Hey, do you think this is the box? It has an X on it and everything. At the foot of 15 lights. So at the bottom of where there are 15 lights. Solved it. Looks like it. Let's go back to Ripley Plaza then. It's over here. Like there was a way up there. Ah, oh, see, I was right. Gray is just hanging out here. Hey, yo, Gray, aren't you? Don't bother me right now. I'm on a mission. See? Ah, oh, I was right. Gray was from here. I should have realized. Well, I didn't realize that. I was about to say I should have realized that. Uh, well, I should have realized he actually probably was part of the city crew because, uh, not because of the eye patch. I thought that was just a cool aesthetic for him, but I, I thought that way more so because he seemed way older than any normal soldier would be and such. So. All boxes are found. Everyone worked very hard. Well done. <laughs> we rock. I must have run around half the city. So what happens to the boxes now? Now he's open box and enjoy contents. Yay, open the boxes. Open the boxes. Each box was open. Hang on, there's notes in here. Let me see. 28756. Memory house. Capped. That's all of them. So then, is this another clue? This one's even harder to get than the last one. That's why we had to find all of them, ain't it? Put them together and they mean something. Look, join them up like this. Capped memory house. Like snow capped? But what would this memory house be? Could be the memorial hall. But what's above there? A road? Wait, I know. It's a Calarian residential quarter. It has to be. And I've heard they've got spare places to stay up there. Huh? Stan, you're so clever. That must be it. Right, so what's the 28756 number then? Some kind of coordina coordinations to the residential quarter or something. Could be the flat number. Nah, I don't think there are that many flats. But if we move it around in the message, it's probably not that complicated. Probably. I thought you were the one who designed these clues. 
Meh, meh. But then who did? Is Gigi not that liable to... I've got it. It's a key code. I bet the flat's got a door where you have to punch in a number to open it. That has to be it, Shiner. How are you so amazing? Yeah, yeah. In that case, it looks like we've somehow stumbled across our second answer. Gigi already say these very special clues. Gigi unable to solve by self. But Gigi knows you capable of solve. Of course we can. Let's see if we were right. To the flats at the top of Memorial Hall. Shiner away. I've got no spark an idea who set this all up. Let's keep playing along for now. Gigi's clear our loss without us. Oh, if we must. Not one to leave a mystery unresolved. Probably do this mission and then I'll continue on with the story. I'm not gonna end the part quite yet. I feel like that's way too soon. <gasps> Especially if it's great if this is like the last thing too. Would you look at that? It really worked. But there's nothing here. I don't think that's quite right. There's a note. Return to the founder, bring, bringing tribute. Meh. It's the next clue. How many of these are there? Did you think this last one? How can you be sure? Because Gigi no answer of clue. I think I know it too. Founder me must mean like the statue of the founders, right? That's not correct. Founder mean person who start thing. So it person who make clues. It point to friend of Gigi. But what about this tribute thing? That easy. It th it think that is favorite of founder. And founder like torpedo warp. Boo, this is just grocery shopping. It's not at all. Really the question behind this is a difficult question that Gigi not able to answer. Gigi need help of everyone to solve last clue. We can do it. We still want to get the treasure. Yeah, we'll do it easy peasy. Well, we ain't gonna leave you high and dry after coming this far, are we? Gigi very grateful. First, we need Torpedo Rob from Best Torpedo Rob Smith Gigi No. Fuck. Okay. Have you seen the founder statues yet? The sta the statues I made of the people who originally built the city. Here's a question for you. Who do you think's the coolest of them? Uh uh, maybe the one on the far left. Oh, so that's what you're into, huh? For me, I guess it would be second from the right. <laughs> Our job isn't scavenging, you know. We recover models too. Both of those tasks go towards protecting our lives in the here and now. But it's the same for both Kevis and Agnes, right? We all rate each other to sustain ourselves. The pattern never changes. But sometimes I'm haunted by the feeling that we could all just find a way to live together somehow. Now, this is definitely the biggest quote-unquote colony there is. I heard you helped Mizuki out with a savage mission the other day. Thanks for that. Don't don't mention it. It was a perfectly natural thing for us to do. Hey, I heard you're an oven fre an oven fresh You're an oven fresh newlywed, is that right? Not that I have a clue what that even means. Kabali told me that if something ever happened to Mizuki he'd cry about. It. I guess he's a pretty important guy then. Yes, Mizuki's more important to me than the air we breathe. I'm so glad he's safe and sound. An oven fresh newlywed, whatever that means. You guys fight with a whole bunch of different weapons, right? How do you find out which ones best suit you? Oh, I guess we just pick out the ones we found easiest to use. So why are you asking us about that, Shiner? I just want to pick your brains. I can tell pretty much any blade now. I could call pretty much any blade now, but you can't win being so flaky, right? I want to sell on a weapon and get good at it. Then maybe someday I'll get to be an Ouroboros kind of like my dad. Like my dad. The dad. This is the place Gigi told us to get to. Can your freshly made torpedo warps here? Sweet or salty, choose your toppings. Enjoy. 
This should be fine, right? Incorrect. One extra sweet pumice honey torpedo wrap, please. There you go. Thank you. I didn't even know they did them like this. It's only available on specials menus. It's very sweet and tasty. But one you just bought also tasty. Gigi would like you to save her. You could have told us that earlier. To miss out on the toppings is a grievous blow indeed. And he's still on about the food. Now everything ready. So where's this founder person anyway? Near to here. At top of back alley steps. Oh, basically. <laughs> okay. Well, now that we know a shorter way up there than going all about the roundabout way that we did the first time we came up here. Oh. I mean, we still know a shorter way there because we actually know where the ladder's at now. Did you all come from the Atea region? Yes, that's right. Did you happen to bump into my husband? So he was heading off towards Milk Meadows. Mm, did we? Come on. Come on. My plumage is everywhere. Where's the tribute? Here, yeah, as desired, extra sweet plumage, honey, torpedo wrap. Perfect. Oh. Yeah. Hi. Nice to meet you. Who are you people? Friends who help solve clues. GG make introductions. This is creative treasure hunt. Wait, please. GG understand. Azera always looking outside here. Azera go out of nighttime and play alone. What Azera really want is not torpedo wrap. It's friends to play with. Uh, no, I don't need friend. Azeli. Something's eating you up, isn't it? Something sad. What was it that happened? What are you thinking? Will you tell me? If I'm alone, I can't get any more lonely than this. Mom got ill and died. And Dad hasn't come home from battle yet. I hate being left behind. Oh, that's a sad goodbye to make. My mom passed away as well, so I know how you feel. Yours too? But this is different. I had so much fun today solving these clues and everyone helped. Maybe one day we won't be together anymore, but that makes it even more important to be together now, right? Like if we weren't together now, I'd just regret it later. What kind of games do you like to play, Azali? I don't really know. Okay, then our next game is find something Azali likes. Get out of here, fly. I love solving tough problems. Which is why I had so much fun with your puzzles, Azalee. Uh, I guess, but... Come on, give us another, hit me! Uh, you want me to now? Whoever solves it wins to the torpedo wrap. But there's only one. You better play to win. Okay, who goes first? Me, I'll do it. Hey, how can I win if I don't even get the answer? That all worked out rather nicely. Gigi, very grateful. Thank you. Question of how to find his daily friends to play with was hardest puzzle of all. Gigi unable to solve this puzzle for longest time, so that why Gigi get everyone involved. I think that was a nice opportunity. Let's just watch them for a while. Yay! They made friends. Sturdy ankles. Alright, we all good? We're all good. Time to continue on with this story. The one time I actually picked the right one. 
Yeah, we'll see how we can get probably a decently good length. Maybe we'll go pick up another one of those other side quests up there too. Unless those are our new colony. We'll see. So who's all still needing to get that class? Mio and Lance, okay. But they're pretty decently close to it, I suppose. At least Mio is. So it's not that big of a stretch to think about. I've been waiting for you. Ship is steady ready. Okay, I'm counting on you to bust out and bring back Gondor. You're counting on us. Count on yourself. You're coming too, aren't you? I'll be accompanying you on the trip, but I'm leaving the actual prison infiltration up to you. Jensen, you're in charge of the infiltration. Understood. Try not to drag us down, Ouroboros. Worry about yourself. Someone tell us the route. Meh. Meh meh. I said before, you cross along Etheria Sea on good ship Bounty. Boundary. Then go to prison directly underneath the castle. Ah, good, right? Through the fog. But here in de is detail of importance. Even if all get there without bumps and bruises, Island is surrounded by a tall cliff on all sides. Boundary only run over water. After that, friends will need to proceed on their own strength. So we just have to do our best to climb up the cliffs without getting rumbled? We can climb up them just by doing our best, and that's great, but first it can't be done. If the prison's in Agnes Castle, then it's gonna be more heavily guarded than any old colony. Right on the money. Before we head for the prison, let's rendezvous with a soldier hiding on nearby Bidzhog home. Her name's Kizame. She's the only soldier who managed to escape from Hope's rest. If we learn about how she managed to escape, can use that information in all infiltration. Is that right? This Venice Sog home is on the way anyway. So rather than fiddle with janky comms, I thought it'd be best to get there and chat. Yeah, makes sense. All right, let's be off. Okay. Alrighty, doodles. Goodest of luck to friends. Wait, are you not piloting us, Mr. Salmon? Salmon has died after a long night of work. Please do not overwork poor Salmon. So who's our pilot then? Pilot is inside you all along. Salmon can send information of directions to any iris. So anyone who wants to pilot can fulfill dream. But however, if break bounty is punished by mega spankings. Yeah, yeah, we get it. Fine, fine. Riku will volunteer for pilot. Is that okay? It's easier than working leftness. Riku was our medic back on the colony. He's good with stuff like this. I trust him to lead us right. Can I trust you not to let me down? Meh. Riku make it smooth sailing. This Gondoria person in prison is our key to find the whereabouts of the true queens. We have to pull this off. The castle beckons. Piloting the bounty. Press any of the bounty to board. Accelerate with ZR, reverse with B, and turn with L, hold A to disembark anywhere at any time. Interesting, Come okay. On. Let's hop on the boundary. You bet. I have an autopilot now. Exit for combat. could do with some food oh this is just the cabin where we oh that's actually cool oh 
Oh my god, the ethereal sea. Oh, yep. Because, yeah, I think ethereal sea was the name of that, um, was the name of the area for Xenoblade Chronicles 1, where you had to, uh, you know, the high entia thing. Oh, fuck, man. Let me look at the map. Oh, dear God. This is a Hulk right here. Huh. I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. I'm ready. Let's do it. I got See you. I got something for you. I'll take them on. Thanks. Oh, wow, okay. Ouroboros in the water, do you actually like stand on the water? That's I don't know, a little bit of their feet in there, but Bullet. 
Maybe, uh, um, Monica has a burst. Completes an order adds 15 TP to adds 15 to TP of the character with the most TP and reactivates them. She has a smash. So she has a smash. Oh, is that also a burst? I didn't see what her top one was. One additional character is reactivated with 20% chance for one more. Finish up. At least we get two back. I use my thinking muscles for this one. You can do. Oh, you're the only one to do. The finisher. Keep hitting hard. Uh! I want to go with him. Don't make this one. Knock back mid arc enemy. Smash. Continue damage fast aggro, okay. That's all I need to know. Yeah! 
Demon Slayer. 200. That was a lot of experience we got, but I was more so about wanting of uh, class points. Oh, I was about to say, what the hell are guests? This is technically like a field, at least I would assume it's a field. It seems more like a field than anything, so. Oh, it's a system I literally just saw right there. Full Metal Jaguar's fucking badass. Nothing's getting past me. What else is her arts that she has? So on armor veil and deals continuous damage to enemies in a fixed radius and draws more aggro. Shockwave with the knockback. We got a smash and we have an ether ink. Okay. I don't really need three tanks. You're closest to that maxing out, so I'm fine with attacking. I think probably what I'll do is. We'll see. I was, I was honestly thinking about I'll wrap up the part once we're done with this mission, but nah, I think I'll continue on just a little bit longer. I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. All set, ready to tumble. Big, you're, you're, you're a lifesaver. You're a lifesaver. Here and now. Here and now. I'm on the way. Keep on pelting. You're a lifesaver. Keep it up, Leo. That's how you pull off a win. Yeah. See if we can keep this up. Yeah. I love it. This game's fantastic. I keep saying it over and over again, but this game's just fucking fantastic. I'm not going to open up those containers because, again, I kind of realized that I don't have all the... But I didn't do the I'll thing. Follow you. On it. On it. And how much is it going to cost? 25. Got enough. Oh yeah, Rana's Hulk rebooted. Now this is the right spot for a rest. Uh, that smarts. What is customers? Come, dum dum, get put kettle on. 
We ain't exactly customers. Shil Shil told us to come here. That's so. It's just like dum dum being daydreamy again and not pay attention. Here it is, stone for friends. Cheers. We'll get where I need to be. Now it's time for tea. Yeah, sorry, we're a bit busy. Friends know who good for good for tea with. Loloka. Loloka is very fun, no pun. That's great. You know what? You should go for tea with Loloka instead of us. Yes, that good plan. Dun Dun and friends used to live heavily on Izan Isle. Lovely island, just right for Loli and about to about and drink tea. But like a customer there, make big reasons for move. Hello, hello. And some high end stuff there. Many full thanks. 1400, okay. Still not the most expensive one. I think the most expensive one still is the one in the Dangon Desert. I think. Or it might be this one. I feel like it should be this one if it's not, considering how far out it is. Okay, it does. I was about to say. Did the, uh. I was about to say if the, uh. Wondering if the guy. I, I wish I could remember the name of the area of uh from Xenoblade One where the high NTL lived. But this is straight up what that it, this that area is. It's straight up this. Fuck. Okay. Oh, I was about to say, uh... Looks like it's where all these quests are. Maybe not. Maybe it is. Well, it's hard to tell with this kind of a map. No, 
not quite. Never mind. Well, let's just go to where we need to go. A lot of places here. I. There. I'm a little worn out, but you don't need to worry about me. So she was all alone out here. Acting alone is better for intelligence gathering and makes it easier to hide. It may have been a strategic decision. May have. We'll see. There's nobody here. Puzzles. This is definitely the rendezvous point. You guys take a load off. Jansen and I will look around. Sure thing. believe my eyes is this real we don't wage many battles at sea so makes sense the seas would be relatively untouched aha uh -huh. when people do die at sea it's usually due to their foronis sinking they drown it's hard to draw out their life with a blade putting it that way i guess it's kind of obvious huh a little ironic that that's why it still looks so pristine. The other half of my reason. Oh, are we talking about that now? About why I'm here, yes. Right? I told you there was a second half. Hmm? It's you, Mia. Ah, the thing, yeah, Me? from way back what when. You... you want to leave an impression on all of us and the world, don't you? I can only hazard a guess at what you'd want it to be. And even then, I'm not confident I'd guess right. But let me just say this. You've only got a little over a month left. We can't change that fact. It doesn't give you much time to leave your mark. <sighs> if there were anything I could do to give you time, if it were in my power, I would. Not just me. Senna, too. And Noah. We all think that way. Mia? Sparks. You're making me tear up here, man. Oh, sorry. That wasn't my intention. No, thank you. Nimue's doing. Huh? You were even being nice to uni. Stuff like that. Oh. Oh, really? I'd never even thought about it. Let's give thanks if we ever see one of those trees of hers. A Sophronia? Right. I think that's a great idea.
good. Everyone's here. Is this the person I made out of the prison camp then? Kisame. Right, sorry to rush you, but can you tell us about the camp? I can. Let's see now. Inside the camp, every prisoner is tracked using identi identification devices. We need those devices to move around the grounds. But if you go if you go anywhere you're not supposed to, they'll trip the alarm and the guards will come running. So you can't go anywhere without them, but they stop you escaping. Crafty so and so's. So, how did you manage to escape? I'll be honest, most of us she of luck. I was working by the western gate when I happened to notice that there were fewer guards than normal. I asked my mates to help, and we got and we got me out alone. In other words, it wouldn't be feasible for us to infiltrate by the same route you used to leave. I imagine we wanted to know. In that case, why not drop the sneaky stuff and just get caught on purpose? It's a decent idea. But if the guards find out you're or Boris, they can't just they could just execute you on the spot. So you can get information out of Gordon on the inside. You should probably avoid revealing to the Agnes that you're Ouroboros. Right, so a saying stealth's the only way to go to get everyone out safely, Gordon included. Since you've mentioned Gordor, we used to gather in the central cell block for more assembly, so it should be easy to make contact, provided you can get in. Good info, thanks. I suppose we'll need more data points on this prison if we we're to figure out a way of infiltrating it. Oh, this is the Agnes Castle. I thought they said it was the Cavesti Castle. No, it makes no, 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 it makes more sense if they, yeah, it's the Agnes that were executing them. Well, I have no idea why I thought they said Cavesti. I figured you might say that, so I got busy while I waited here, observing Agni and troops. Seems to me you might have more luck and information from them, seeing as how I only saw one part of the prison. Prison Isle. Oh my god. Actually, wait, no. That don't make I was about to say, you know, it makes sense that the Agni Castle is in this area, considering this is where the High Anti is. But no, that doesn't make sense at all, because the Queen of Cavesi is the High Entia, and this is where High Entia is. Can you see that island to the northwest? That's Corn Island. I saw the Agni transport Balenia headed that way. It's most likely left from the castle, so if you can access a terminal or something, you might be able to learn a thing or two. And then there's Turbian Island to the northeast. It has the Ethereum re Relay Base on it, permitted, permitted garrison and all, so you won't have trouble finding information there. It sounds like we'll have to accept a certain level of risk since there's no other way. We just want info, right? We can slip in and out without getting caught quick as you like. Yes, I would like that, but no, how likely does it sound? More data on the prison is important, sure, but it won't mean much if we don't figure out how to circumvent the ID devices. Here, you can use this. This is the device they put on me. And these... These are the ones for my friends who died in the camp. Should be enough for all of you, and then some. Thanks, we appreciate it. Jensen? About those ID devices. Might let me have a crack. I think I can pull the warning systems out of them. And since you need a few, I'd like to borrow Nisik. Understood, thank you. So, the device in Kratos' hands. We'll see what we can find out on Corny Island, Turban Island. Time for a tea break. Alrighty. Well, I think this is a good spot to end this video off, guys. This is uh Oh, this map alone is just ugh. This map alone is just giving me fucking anxiety just because of the just look at it 
Like, what the fuck? I don't know, man. That's crazy. Banana pants here, but... Oh, well. But anyway, guys, that's gonna do it. Wait, did that... No, I was about to say, did another quest just pop up? No. But, guys, that's gonna do it for this part of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 3, guys. In the next part, we'll, uh... We'll do something, I'm sure. What? I don't know. I mean, we'll do the main quest, I'll maybe. Or we might do those side quests there. We'll see. But anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. Guys, if you liked the video, please give the like button a click. And comment down below if you liked about the video, didn't like about the video. And let me know, guys, what you think of uh, the ship. Very interesting that uh, with the ship now. So I like that. I like that a lot. It's really nice. It adds a new spin to the Xenoblade formula in a, in a way. The good news is you don't actually get attacked in it, too. So that's great. But yeah, let me just. As always, guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to the main channel, too. That's in the description below. As well as find me on Twitter. Both my main Twitter, the RPG, Kim Kid Twitter, are in there, too. Thank you all so much for watching once again. And I'll see you all next time.